SpaceX versus Blue Origin The Battle for Space Travel Have you ever wondered which space company is going to rule the space and win the space race? Well, Elon Musk's SpaceX is the company that instantly pops up in our mind. But with that, we also get the heated gigantic rockets of Jeff Bezos' Blue Origin in mind. Something has created the hype on the internet about space like never before. Jeff Bezos will be soon on the moon with his brother even before Elon Musk. This has waged a battle between SpaceX and Blue Origin. That's why in our today's video, we have decided to talk about SpaceX versus Blue Origin, the battle for the space travel. But before we get into the video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more interesting videos. Having said that, Buckle your seatbelts to get the space trip. Over the last 14 years, both Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos have engaged themselves in a very incredible competition about ruling the space, ultimately winning the space race. And to achieve this, we have seen one of the most heated but humble races between the two. Both even remained the world's richest man at the respective time and both are the world's most powerful CEOs whom we know. Jeff Bezos is the CEO of Amazon, while Elon Musk is leading two companies, Tesla on one side and SpaceX on the other. But the question that pops up in mind is when these two space companies were actually launched. After successfully launching Amazon back in 1995, Jeff Bezos launched Blue Origin in 2000, apparently due to his ambition to settle millions of people on other planets. While Elon Musk, back in 2002, sold PayPal and got $160 million to use in launching his space company, SpaceX. In the same year, Elon Musk successfully appeared as the most powerful rivalry of Blue Origin. And that was the year when the battle silently started. Let's head towards the first face-to-face -face heated discussion between Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos back in 2004. At that time, both the space company CEOs met at the dinner to share some thoughts about the space. Neither of the companies had launched even a single rocket to space at the time, as they were in the initial development phase. It was rumored that both the CEOs indulged in a heated discussion. As a result of the difference of opinions about space, everyone knew at that time that this rivalry is going to last far than anyone can ever imagine. Two space companies with their CEOs had started working painstakingly to be the ruler of the space, and we are still seeing this till today. Another fight between SpaceX and Blue Origin took place in 2013 over NASA's launch pad. SpaceX got the chance of using NASA's launch pad exclusively, which Blue Origin condemned. Even Blue Origin started talking to the government and said that every private company could get a chance to use NASA's launch pad. Everyone knew at that time that Blue Origin was way too behind SpaceX, which was continuously making breathtaking progress at a mind-blowing speed. Various fights took place between these two companies over time, and mostly SpaceX seemed to be winning every time. There are quite a few distinctions that SpaceX has which make it more famous and competitive over Blue Origin. Even NASA collaborated with SpaceX to send its astronauts to space. SpaceX resulted in the foundation of another marvelous company known as Starlink that focuses on providing internet service using satellites. These hundreds of satellites have been sent to space using SpaceX's rocket successfully, which suggested that SpaceX had more weight than Blue Origin. Even SpaceX got praised by Jeff Bezos too. When SpaceX conducted a test launch of the Starship spacecraft, Bezos, impressed by the promising results of the launch, praised SpaceX publicly. The rocket was launched thousands of feet above the land in the air for about seven minutes, and on return, the rocket was exploded. Everyone knew how crucial and important that seven minutes of the successful launch was, and Bezos knew that too. Accepting and commending what SpaceX had achieved and what it could accomplish suggested that even Bezos himself knew that SpaceX could be leading very soon. The next milestone just amazed the world when NASA did a contract with SpaceX. This contract, worth about $2.9 billion, was one of its kind that made SpaceX the only space company to take humans and land them on the moon. 
As soon as the news spread, Blue Origin stepped forward and challenged NASA's decision about the contract and declared it to be flawed. NASA had earlier said that it will grant permission and contract to two space companies, and everyone knew that they will be SpaceX and Blue Origin. But due to some budget problems, NASA had to go with only SpaceX. Though this contract created chaos among the Blue Origin team, many think that SpaceX deserved to be the sole recipient of the contract. But here is something that has recently created the hype on the internet like never before. Even more than that of SpaceX, and that's Bezos going to space with his younger brother. This space trip is going to be the first private human travel to space, and Bezos is doing it so by using his latest new Shepard spacecraft. Bezos revealed earlier that he always wanted to go and explore space, and even he wanted to create colonies for humans, same as Elon Musk thinks. No doubt, Bezos is pushing Elon Musk behind, but only in traveling to space. Many think that if Elon Musk had wanted to travel to space, then he would have done it even years ago, before Bezos going to space. Now, let's move toward the most interesting question. Whether SpaceX would be ruling the space or the Blue Origin will be winning the competition. SpaceX has numerous advantages over Blue Origin, mainly due to the extensive research and experimental launches that SpaceX has done so far. SpaceX has a fleet of flight-proven hardware, gigantic rockets like Falcon 9, that witnessed many trips to space, Falcon Heavy rockets, and Dragon spacecrafts. All these mind-blowing superiorities make SpaceX many times more competitive than Blue Origin. The Blue Origin's latest New Glenn rocket is still in development that is considered to be a competitor for SpaceX's Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy rockets, but it's all estimation. SpaceX has experience of hundreds of launches, while on other hand, Blue Origin seems to be lagging behind. We don't know with certainty which space company will win the battle, but one thing that we can say with certainty is that this battle is going to continue until humans start living on Mars. Who do you think will win the space race and rule the moon and Mars, SpaceX or Blue Origin? Don't be shy to comment right below which space company do you love the most and why. Before going anywhere, make sure to subscribe to our channel, press the like button, and hit the bell icon to watch interesting videos on your YouTube dashboard. Until the next video, stay tuned. Uh, why space? With, with SpaceX, it's uh, trying to help um, solve the kind of space bearing problem. Um, I mean, I, I, I think that a, a future where we're a space bearing civilization um, and a, a multi planet species is a very exciting, inspiring, awesome future. Mm -hmm.